My father started the business. Uh, he was a innkeeper up in uh, two hours north of New York City in a country inn. Met an Englishman who'd been in the tea business for three generations in London. And um, then uh, that's how he started to learn about tea. Uh, when he was 53, he started Harney and Sons. So you may know 53, uh, many of us uh, think our lives are starting to uh, wind down, but his picked up. What several years ago, what we had done when uh, the invasion happened in 22, we gave 100% uh, of the proceeds to help in the Ukraine. So that was, uh, we were able to generate $150,000, which we kept, kept going. We've always uh, helped out uh, many causes, and uh, this one, 10% uh, of the proceeds is uh, going from from your purchase. And then the uh, my brother and I, my mother, uh, my family, were uh, contributing another 10%. So that's 20% of all the sales is going uh, to help out through Razam. It was pretty split second. We've done this with other things where we've helped out causes, but that's the largest amount of money we've ever raised for uh, a cause. So that was uh, was lovely. We had this tea, uh, it, it turns out there's chamomile and lavender and cornflowers, so that's yellow and blue. We thought uh, chamomile is a very nice tisane that uh, we get ours from Egypt, so it's very sweet tasting. And I have a French wife, so uh, lavender from uh, France made some sense to me. It's a, uh, a blended tisane, so it's not 100% chamomile. Um, you know, it's not 100% teal or something like that. So it's a blend of, uh, of, uh, of that. And it's um, a steady eddy, I might say. Uh, you know, every day, everyone, somebody drinks it. Uh, it's, a, it's a lovely thing. And now we're able to support the Ukraine with it. You know, my mother is, uh, she's an amateur historian, she's 93, but uh, she has uh, read a lot about uh, this area uh, with uh, Solzhenitsyn and other people we have uh, been following in that area and uh, freedom uh, is something that we care about.